things have seemed mostly calm around Mirlan Manigá, the former first lady who appears to be the leader in the wake of Haiti's presidential election. She does, however, oppose a recount, not trusting electoral authorities. There is a matter of confidence, and we do not trust the CP. The 70-year-old law professor indicated to the Associated Press she was open to power-sharing agreements to end Haiti's political stalemate. She noted with outsiders bankrolling the election and more, the country isn't yet in control of its own destiny. If ever I was president of Haiti, before that, I would not find myself in this present situation. And if I am elected president, I am a very reasonable person. It's out of my intention to challenge the international community or the United Nations or OAS. Maniga has also said if she's elected, her first priorities would be dealing with a deadly cholera epidemic and finding ways to house more than a million left homeless by last January's massive earthquake. The top two candidates were supposed to face off in a runoff in January. They have through Wednesday to legally challenge the first round results of the balloting. Karen Sloan, The Associated Press.